Hi everybody, it's Jilly, Jilly B living her life her way. I hope you're all fit, well and healthy. I am um, just sharing a video. I've been to the post office today. It's a new stamp release with the postcards as well. And it's the Admin Classic Stamp Set. I haven't bought every one because uh, too expensive. So, but I'm going to show you what I bought. So this is from the post office. And I have a little delivery from the Royal Mail as well. So, let's see. So, I bought some postcards and these are the stamps that I bought. So, let's have a look. So, I didn't buy lots and lots of stamps because stamps are expensive. But I just wanted some of the stamps. Um... But let's see what I got. So these are the um, Chicken Run. Uh, this is from Chicken Run and it's Rocky and Ginger. And these are the second class ones. Feathers McClaw, McCraw. The wrong trousers. And they're all um, the same. So absolutely lovely. I'll just bring my lamp across a bit so you can see a bit better. to see a bit better now so yeah so i bought six of these stamps and these will do for uk post crossing or if i'm sending something to perhaps to lewis or somebody like that or rob that dad guy i can add one of these with the international stamp so they're the second class stamps that i bought the second set i bought are first class stamps and i bought 12 of these so i've got wallace and gromit aren't they amazing wallace and gromit there and we've got frank there so yeah i think they're just oh, i just love admin they're just amazing so there's the second class let's move them out of the way and these um, will be used for my friend mail and post crossing. I do not swap sheets of stamps or stamps just like this. I don't do that. I can't do it. I need them for my post crossing and my friend mail. If anybody would like to buy these stamps, you just go on to the Royal Mail and it's www.royalmail.com and they deliver all over the world, everywhere, international, all over the world. And um, yep. So that's all you need to do if you want to buy some. Or go to your post office if you're in the UK. And these are my £1.85 stamps. So we've got Timmy there. Timmy's from Sean the Sheep. And then we've got Morph and Charles there. Now many maybe if you're not from the UK, you don't know who this is, Morph. Um, there used to be a gentleman, I think it was called Tony Hart. If you uh, look up Tony Hart... Um, art, Tony Hart. Um, he used to have an artist style programme for children back in the day and Morph was in his programme. I'm sure it's um, Tony Hart. So yeah, so these are the stamps I bought for my postcards. I think they're amazing. And I bought the postcard, the postcards, the postcards to match let me have a look there's 13 postcards in here so let's get a look and so these the stamps i've bought it gives you a better chance a better idea of what they look like so we've got rocky and ginger there from a, a chicken one is it i can't really call it already uh, uh, rocky and ginger can't see it on there but yeah chicken i'm sure it's chicken run so there we are the next one is feathers and craw <laughs> this naughty 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 penguin i love it at the scene where the train in his uh grommets lane the train very quickly the track for the train i've got wallace and grommet with their cheese and crackers we have frank 
Frank um, is from a programme where they do interviews with animals. It's really good. If you haven't seen any of these, go on YouTube and just, just put them in, you'll find them. Timmy from Shaun the Sheep. More from Chaz. Yeah, he, in a programme when I was a child, absolutely brilliant. We've got Robin. We've got Sean and Bitzer, the sheepdog from Sean the Sheep. I didn't, obviously I haven't got these stamps because they're 255 ones and I don't really use them. So we have a close shave, first class stamp, which I haven't got. We have a matter of love and death. That's a brilliant, brilliant uh, fill in that one. There's the wrong trousers and there's the track I was talking about. A grand day out where Wallace and Gromit go up on the moon to try the cheese. And then there's this uh, little pack here, which I think I've bought that in my envelope. So I'll go to my envelope. And see what we have. Right, get them out of the way. So, so yeah, so this came in the mail today. It was posted yesterday. So I was quite lucky to get it so quickly. And this is what I bought from the Royal Mail. Sadly, I didn't get the other first class stamps. I was hoping the post office would have had them, but they didn't. So, uh, these are the ones I mean. Oh, actually, I do have them. So that's. Let's get that out of that sheet. So, this is a whole sheet of the Wallace and Gromit um, stamps. These are for my post crossing and friend mail. I may keep some of them as well. Do you know, these are different. These are. Oh my goodness, these are sticker ones. These are very new. I've just noticed that. My other stamps, let me just grab them. Uh, so the Marines were the last ones that came out. You have to, um, they're the ones with the glue on the back. So you glue them on or lick them, whatever you want. I normally glue mine. And these ones are sticker ones. I've, I've just realised that. So they're very new. So I will be keeping some of those for my collection. So let's just move them out of the way. What else did I get? Then I got this, which is a the stamp sheet. Admin's Classic Stamp Sheet. So if I just lift this up. So these are the post the postcards there that I um, haven't got like in a sheet, but they're on here. So there's the wrong trousers there. We've got the wrong trousers as well. <laughs> We've got a matter of low for death, and then we have a cross shave. Now these ones I will not be using them. And these are, oh my gosh, they're stickers as well. So they're normally a sheet and they, um, you can see the perforations in the back. These are the newest ones and these are sticker ones. So this is the first time I've got the sticker style ones. So that's all very new, isn't it? So they must be doing away with sticking, sticking them on. Now, I don't know how that will work for people who um, steam or soak their stamps. I don't know how that will work for people when they've, like, they're a gluey background. I'm not sure. And again, I've got another pack of the postcards because I like them that much. So I don't know which one's my favorite. I do like this sticker sheet, this uh, stamp sheet here. It just feels so strange that they're now not like the stamps that they used to be. What do you think about that, guys? It's a bit strange, isn't it? Not having the the ones with the gummed backs. Mm. But I still love them. I think they're amazing. Look at these stamps. I love the scene as well. 
got Wallace and Gromit there. You've got the uh, rockets on the on the wall on the wallpaper. They're hanging uh, this picture. I think the hammer's maybe a little bit too big <laughs> for the task ahead. And poor Gromit, oh, you're going to get a squashed paw, I think. But yeah, I think they're brilliant. I absolutely love uh, Wallace and Gromit and, and uh, Ardman and all the rest. So I think I've been very lucky to buy these today. Uh, it's quite quickly. They've come out quite quickly after the marine ones. And, uh, I didn't buy many of the marine ones because... Um, I didn't find them very joyful, to be fair. That's probably why I didn't buy them. But yeah, that is the new stamp haul from the stamp release from uh, Royal Mail with uh, lovely stamps. Please tell me in the comments which is your favourite. And my favourite has to be on here. Let me see. And it's this one, where they're on the train. The wrong trousers absolutely love that <laughs> so yeah and there it is postcard style that's my favorite one that film i have fond memories of it when my children were small watching it on the television just great fun absolutely great fun so yep so there you go guys that is my video of the new stamp release from the royal mail i will leave a link in the description box if anybody wishes to purchase them from the Royal Mail um, so yeah so and I'm just wondering now because this is new would this be more of a collector's item because they're not the perforated stamps anymore maybe my um, clever stamp collecting friends would be able to advise me on that I'm so glad I bought that now <laughs> so guys there you go that's my video I hope you enjoyed it. I hope uh, you like the new stamps and I hope you go buy some as well. Do let me know in the comments which was your favourite um, and what was your favourite Admin classic as well. Okay guys, until the next time, do stay well, safe and happy. Bye bye now, bye bye.